So we are learning about the earth and its layers this week. This is a picture of the earth and its layers. The top layer is the crust, underneath that is the mantle, then the outer core and the inner core. You can see the inner core is the centermost part of our earth. There are two parts to the core, the inner core and outer core, then the mantle and the crust. The middle part of the earth is called the core. The core is the innermost layer of the earth. It is much denser than the mantle because it has to carry all the weight of the layers above it. The inner core is a solid, but the outer core is a liquid. The core is about 7,000 degrees Celsius, which is as hot as the sun. The inner core is mostly iron. The outer core is made of iron mixed with other materials. The mantle of the earth. The mantle of the earth is above the core. It is a thick layer that contains most of earth's mass or weight. The inner part of the mantle is very hot rock that is liquid called magma that is slowly moving. The outer part of the mantle is solid rock like the earth's crust. The mantle is made up of oxygen, silicone, magnesium, and iron. The Earth's crust. The crust is the part of the Earth that we live on. It includes soil and rock. The thickness of the crust varies. The part that is covered by water is 6 to 11 kilometers thick, while the part that is covered in land is 35 to 40 kilometers thick. Compared to the size of the earth, the crust is just a thin shell. The crust is made mostly of oxygen and some silicone, aluminum, iron, and calcium. The earth's atmosphere. The atmosphere of the earth is the layer of gas surrounding the earth. It is kept in place by gravity. It allows us to breathe and survive. It is made up of nitrogen, oxygen, carbon dioxide, and water that cycle through the environment. And keep in mind, water that cycles through the environment would be rain, snow, sleet, hail, any form of precipitation. The lithosphere. The lithosphere is the Earth's crust and the upper part of the Earth's mantle. The lithosphere is broken into pieces called tectonic plates. Continental crust is crust that makes up the land. Oceanic crust is the ocean floor. Earth's plates rest on a soft solid in the mantle called magma. Next week, we're going to be learning more about tectonic plates and our oceanic and continental crust.